Hello, my name is Adam Bean and today I would like to show you how to receive server sent events uh, with nothing but uh, HTML5 standards using the browser APIs. So um, we have here a uh, the, the, the simplest possible sender of uh, server sent events and this is in um, Java E8 um, app just comprising one class. And what it does, it sends every two seconds uh, the, uh, the current time. And um, so what we can do, so we need first the URI of that. And this is uh, localhost 8080 is where the Glassfish v5 runs the server. And then comes SSE is the uh, project name, then resources, because we have here the resources uh, URI. And then what we get is the beats um, URI. Uh, or beats path. So uh, what I would need to do is to curl it with minus i and localhost 8080, then SSE, resources, and then beats. So and what happens is uh, we get uh, the data every two seconds. And we see the content type is text event stream, which is the MIME time for the um, uh, for the SSE server send events. And what I also did, I installed the course headers. So if we take a look here at the um, at the POM, there is a course because I would like to connect from another server to this server to make it more realistic. So now we have the first client, and here we have an. Simplistic HTML5 app, no frameworks. It's just a simple HTML5 page and uh, a JavaScript uh, class or script which is loaded. And it's not a class, but now it's going to be a class. Class app, or let's call it um, events. And uh, I will start with the constructor. And I would like to keep it simple, so I would do everything in the constructor, and just say this events uh, events equals new event source, and this event source is a built-in uh, built-in object. So what I would like to do is just to take the uh, URI, and this is this one, and to paste it here. So then I would like to register as register the on open callback I will just make it a little bit larger this events uh, on open and register listener and this is the event and then I would just like to print out the event and then I would like to receive the um, the messages and this is going to be on message. console log and the message. So let's see what happens. Nothing because I didn't instantiate the constructor. So let's do this. Uh, new event So and of course what's wrong here? The URI. So try it again. It looks better. So we have the first event, which is the open event, and then we get a message event. And um, as we can see, we have here an attribute data, which we can, of course, um, more easily access using the structuring. So I'll just do this. So I would like to only have the data here and use the data here. And now what we get, we get the current time from the Java 8 server just by using a simplistic ES6 class. So thank you for watching. If you're interested, check out the Web Standards Igniter online, online course or come to Airport Munich, see you at conferences, workshops or even projects. So thank you for watching and bye.